thecocktailenvy.com. Welcome back to The Cocktail Envy. It's Mike Fuller, your host, and today we're making guacamole. Uh, this is really, really good, and I used to hate it. <laughs> so, I don't know why. Maybe it's the color of Shrek. Could be. But needless to say, I've taken a liking to it, so I've mastered it, and I want to share it with you. I've already got all the ingredients cut up, diced up, everything's ready to go. Um, you can get the exact measurements on the website, The Cocktail Envy. Dot com and uh, here we go. So I've got about three or four ripe um, avocados and I've already peeled them, seeded them, cut them and then what we're going to do is we're going to add red onion. Red onion to the mixture. Jalapeno peppers. I'm going to use about a half of a fresh jalapeno pepper or about ten uh, pickled jalapeno rings I actually like the pickled jalapeno rings myself. Cilantro, fresh cilantro. Do not buy the uh, this kind, the dried cilantro. Use fresh. <laughs> Okie dokie. Then next what we're going to do is uh, we're going to take a lime. About a half a lime put it in our little juicer here. You can use lime juice uh, from the little green plastic lime. I recommend using a real lime with a juicer. You, these are cheap. You can pick them up. Uh, I think I have a link to them maybe on my website too. Imagine that. And uh, with the lime, the salt, the pepper, basically everything in here, it's all to taste preference. Um, this is kind of the basics. We're going to give you the tools and we want you to go to work in the garden and make something that you like yourself. Yeah, that sounded kind of funny, but... So we got about a half a lime. Lime. I'm going to put three to eight turns of uh, fresh ground pepper and Coca-Cola. Now that's a little different than a lot of people no, I'm just kidding. This is actually salt. It's like a mini salt shaker, uh, just shaped like a Coca-Cola bottle. This is not actually Coca-Cola. Um, and we're going to put a little bit of that, probably about a tea teaspoon. I'm not sure. Check the website, thecocktailenvy.com, to get the uh, exact. And honestly, this is about it. Um, you want to smash it. This is actually a ground beef smasher. Uh, I believe it was from the uh, Pampered Chef. And, but it works really well for the, uh, the guacamole. Now, you can smash your guacamole as much as you'd like. Um, some people like it chunky. Some people like it smashed and mashed. It's actually kind of a pain in the butt and somewhat messy. But, nonetheless, smash away. Smash, smash, smash. Until you get it how you like it. getting close, which is a good thing because my arm is getting tired. Okay, that's about enough. Alright, then just take a regular spoon, kind of get it all blended up, all mixed up. When you're picking your avocados, uh, what you want to do is look for the ripe ones. The ripe ones are the softer ones. Just squeeze it a little bit. <laughs> and uh, that's how you'll want to pick a nice avocado. Oh, this looks really good. This is so green. Even Shrek would like it. 
Like I said, this is about uh, three to four small to medium avocados. This will make enough for about four people at a get together. Um, if you want a bigger batch than that, you might as well just hijack an avocado truck because you're going to need a lot of avocados for that. So I don't know anything about that. But this right here, this is a good size uh, to start the party out. And as you can see, this, if you can, it's really starting to look good. And I hope it tastes good. I think it will. All right. Put it in your bowl. If you take this to the party, Cinco de Mayo, what have you, your friends are going to love you. And here we have my best guacamole dip. Hmm. That's really good. So, until next time, mahalo. Visit www.thecocktailenvy.com for all your party needs.